What's up, YouTube? This is James coming back at you with another informative video. I hope everybody's doing well out there on this nice, beautiful Thursday. I'm doing really good myself. I come across this uh, story right here that's very offensive. You understand? As far as I'm concerned, the doctor got what he got. He paid the price. You understand? Well, what I'm saying is this. Y'all ever seen these uh, little commercials or even in some shows where, you know, a man's ready to go get a prostate exam and the doctor's standing up there sliding the glove on with this old devious ass look on his face while he's snapping the glove all that and all that kind of shit, you know, getting off just thinking about the idea of digging around in a man's ass. That shit ain't cool. And the thing is, is this, as far as I'm concerned, they in a modern day like this, Modern time, modern medicine, they need to come up with a new way to check a man's prostate. All right? That shit ain't cool. But this doctor right here, <laughs> let's get into the story. Meanwhile, in Florida, homophobic man shoots doctor for making him orgasm during prostate exam. Oh, well. I have no sympathy for the doctor whatsoever. You understand what I mean? That shit is not cool. You see? <sighs> let's get into this shit, man. You know... Nobody likes going to the doctor, especially for prostate exams. But we don't hold that against the doctors themselves. I do. I never had one, and I don't plan on getting one. And may the most high bless me to never have to worry about getting one. You understand? Now, to continue, then again, we're not from Florida. And one man from the Sunshine State didn't like how his, appointed, his appointment uh, with an MT went down and shot him. All right, you know, uh, let's back up. The patient's name is Milo Johannes, Johannesson, and he's a car salesman in Jacksonville. The dude's beef, which is his doctor, Dr. Smith, gave him an orgasm during a prostate exam. All right, see, I can understand how Mr. Johannesson felt. You know what I'm saying? That shit ain't cool, man. That shit ain't cool. They need to come up with a new way to check a man's prostate. See? Now to continue, apparently, this isn't unusual. The prostate is like a male G-spot and it carries semen. It is very sensitive. So when it is touched and massaged, you get an orgasm with almost no effort. Dr. Smith explained. All right? Uh... I'm going to pause for a second and I'm going to tell you, I saw this, I think it was, um, damn, Law and Order back in the day, probably about, oh man, a few years ago, the chick that played Wonder Woman named Linda Carter and what she was doing, she had a daughter and they was actually raping men. This is what they was doing. Okay. They would drug them. They would, she would send her daughter in there. She would drug the man. You know, he'll fall out and they'll stick a cattle prog up his to his rear end, make him climax and then uh, get his semen and then knock her up. You know what I mean? And then turn around. These was rich men that they was doing that shit to. Then turn around and blackmail him. You know what I mean? And every damn thing else for child support or whatever. You know, then they'll abort the baby. I think it went something like that. Just straight up sinister, wicked and evil. You know, that's when I knew then that, yeah, it's a situation that like that can happen, you know, you know, but and these damn prostate exam doctors, y'all motherfuckers knew it too. That's the reason why I don't have no sympathy for Dr. Smith ass. Now, be that as may I digress, let's go on with the story. Um, Johannesson is said to be deeply homophobic and he should be. Though so, I added that, you know, uh, though, so he must have felt unmoored when he accidentally shot his wad during the exam damn i understand that milo was shocked by what happened to him an orgasm meant something sexual had taken place between us and he became very aggressive dr smith said and i bet you your ass was surprised when he took it pulled out you know what i mean the strap on you and you know pop, pop, you know what i mean and that's just all there is to it all right now in conclusion, Johannesson ordered the doctor to apologize and say, no homo, a phrase the doctor was unfamiliar with. He tried to calm Johannesson down, but the homophobe pulled 
his gun and shot Dr. Smith twice in the chest at close range. Whew. <laughs> ah, the doctor has fully recovered, but Johannesson has not been since seen. Well, seen since. All right. Y'all can't find this dude. He must have ran down south. <laughs> <laughs> that was a thing back in the day. You know, that's what Jimi Hendrix said in the, in the, in the song called Hey Joe. I'm going way down south. Way down the Mexico way. So go and check down south. You know what I mean? But on the, on the real though, I hope Johannesson gets away. You know what I mean? I hope Y'all go ahead and leave him alone. Find a new way to take a man's prostate and let that bullshit go, right? Now, what we don't get is why Johannesson didn't a, just appreciate that his produce what procedure was not only painless but pleasurable. Oh, this some satire shit, man. I don't believe that this 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 is real. Okay, you know uh, what he should have done instead of shooting the doctor is gone home and showed his girlfriend how to do his new favorite move. Fuck that. Now, see, I think this some shit is a satire story. To promote fagism. You see what I'm talking about? I, I really do believe that. You know, why would this man feel like that's something? And that's probably the right reason why these sissies get off, of, you know, doing this kind of shit. You know? How sick. Well, one thing for sure. Dr. Smith, your ass better get a new profession. Because you see, ain't nobody playing all this nasty ass bullshit. Y'all tell me what y'all think about this situation right here. I'm interested in hearing y'all views on it. Uh, like, comment, share, and subscribe. People, please remember to live your life as though we are being watched. Simply because we are, this is James, and I'm out. Peace.